who's covering many of these areas affected in the upstate. We've got team coverage tonight. It begins with Ann Maxwell in Easley, where they did get a lot of damage in the early morning hours. 7 News Ann Maxwell just back from Easley. The National Weather Service says a tornado touched down in Easley early this morning, but thankfully no injuries were reported. Winds up to 80 miles an hour toppled trees, downed power lines, and damaged cars and buildings before 4 o'clock Monday morning. We got the, uh, the alert on the phone and woke up, and I looked out front, um, and when the lightning flashed, you could, you could see um, everything out front. That's where this oak tree had fallen. Just thankful we were okay. Um, my daughter and granddaughter live in the back part of our house and just thankful they were okay too. Her daughter says she didn't even hear the tree fall because the tornado itself was so loud. It's scary. Yeah, There's lots of noises, lots of wind and rain. You couldn't see outside of our window. A few blocks over an uprooted tree landed on cars. Power lines around the city were grounded. And our power has been out. Um, since then, according to the National Weather Service, the tornado tore through a seven mile stretch starting east of Easley and traveling parallel to Main Street. The tornado spanned an estimated 30 yards at the widest. This is kind of crazy, but again, thankful everybody is safe. This was not something that would cross my mind, especially with everything else going on right now. But you know, let's pile it on. <laughs> Crews continue to work to get the power back on in Easley and Maxwell 7 News.